Next time when your kids ask you to bring them a star from the sky, you don't have to shrug and walk away. Tell them to wait instead. Scientists from different countries like the U.S., China, Russia, and many more are mulling a bold idea to travel to space to capture a small, near-Earth asteroid, which might be a potential threat and bring it back to Earth to exploit its resources. The asteroid is valued at 700 quintillion dollars, which means that if it were divided equally amongst the world's population, we'd all get 93 billion dollars each. Space is not just dull and dark. It's filled with wealth and interesting stuff. We're going to the moon, we're going to Mars, and before you know it, we'll be going to the asteroid belt. The government won't eye a certain thing unless it's beyond what you're thinking. They all want to explore a giant metallic asteroid with metals worth a gargantuan 700 quadrillion dollars. The asteroid is supposed to contain different valuable metals like platinum, iron, nickel, but the most valuable of them all, gold. That's why it's often colloquially called the golden asteroid because it contains metals worth more money than the world's billionaires collectively own. Gold. With every eye on the golden asteroid, the question is, would there be a new gold rush? Would a grand adventure like the Alaska Gold Rush in 1896 or something worse be experienced again? The Alaska Gold Rush was a migration of thousands and thousands of prospectors into the Klondike region of the Yukon in northwestern Canada between 1896 and 1899 where gold was discovered. Unfortunately, the majority went in vain, but some did become wealthy. So what do you think will happen this time as we explore space for gold in space? Let me know in the comments below. When a certain thing, especially when related to space and worth a huge amount of money like 700 quadrillion dollars is announced, of course, Elon Musk is on the front row. NASA has roped in billionaire Elon Musk to help it probe the asteroid psyche that contains enough gold to make everyone on Earth a billionaire. Now, the Psyche mission will journey to a unique metal-rich asteroid, also named Psyche or 16 Psyche, which orbits the Earth between Mars and Jupiter. So, how does he plan to do it? Well, watch the video to the end and everything you need to know will be discussed. But, before that, give this video a like button, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you get notified every time an interesting video is dropped. What is this asteroid all about? Well, many years ago, Earth and other planets began to condense, and dust became rocks, and rocks became building blocks of planets. But most of these were knocked out into deep space, or aggregate, to become the solar system's planets and moons. But a few hundred million never got big enough. Asteroids are the little chunk of protoplanets that never made it. Astronomers on Earth have studied 16 Psyche in visible and infrared wavelengths, as well as radar, which suggests that Psyche is shaped somewhat like a potato. Observations indicate its dimensions are about 173 miles by 144 miles by 117 miles. That's 279, 232, and 189 kilometers, respectively. Now, Psyche orbits the Sun between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter at a distance ranging from 235 million to 309 million miles, 378 million to 497 million kilometers from the Sun. That's 2.5 to 3.3 astronomical units. The alleged plan is to go there by 2022 and observe and learn more about the asteroid, but it could also possibly be mined later on. As for the true intentions of SpaceX when it comes to this asteroid, we'll have to wait and see. The 226 kilometer wide asteroid is situated in the solar system's asteroid bed between Mars and Jupiter. Why is this particular asteroid of interest to scientists? The asteroid could contain certain potential riches that can beat the total cost of the entire world's global economy. An asteroid valued at 700 quintillion means that if it were divided equally among the world's population, we'd all get $93 billion each. So poverty, forget about it, out the window. The value of this asteroid could make everyone rich. If SpaceX were able to go forth with the mining, however, it would be more than enough to fund a whole expansion to another planet, which is definitely one of Elon Musk's dreams to go to Mars. Although the trip is said to take place in 2022, who knows if the timeline would be accelerated even before that. 
SpaceX company is vital for this asteroid mining because of its main aim is to reduce the price of taking equipment into space. Normally it costs 60000 per kilogram to get spacecraft from sea level to low Earth orbit in today's dollars, and that's extremely expensive. SpaceX is following a plan to make a super heavy lift launch vehicle capable of taking over 45 tons to low Earth orbit. Building the super heavy lift vehicle is a smart decision because as the size and mass of a rocket increases, the cost per kilogram goes down. SpaceX is currently developing the Big Falcon rocket, or BFR, which is said to be capable of carrying a payload of 150 tons for $7 million, which is $50 per kilogram. But even if the spacecraft does successfully reach the asteroid, there are currently no plans for mining or to remove the metal. NASA says the trip's simply a research mission to examine what the asteroid is made of. The Psyche mission will be NASA's first time investigating a world of metal rather than a world of rock and ice. Psyche 16 is nestled between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter, as we said, and made of a solid metal. That means if we bring it back to Earth, it would destroy commodity prices and cause the world's economy worth $75.5 trillion to collapse. NASA scientists believe 16 Psyche is a survivor of collisions between planets, which were common when the solar system was forming. That means it could tell us how the Earth's core and the cores of other planets were formed. According to NASA, one of the most intriguing targets in the main asteroid belt 16 Psyche is a giant metal asteroid about three times farther away from the Sun than is the Earth. The average diameter is about 140 miles or 226 kilometers and 1 16th of the diameter of the Earth's moon or about the distance between Los Angeles and San Diego. Unlike most other asteroids that are rocky or icy bodies, scientists think the M-type metallic asteroid 16 Psyche is comprised mostly of metallic iron and nickel, very similar to Earth's core. Scientists wonder whether Psyche could be an exposed core of an early planet, maybe as large as Mars that lost the rocky outer layers due to several violent collisions billions of years ago. The giant rock, which is about 140 miles across, is found in an asteroid belt in the solar system between Mars and Jupiter. The asteroid was named after the nymph Psyche, who married Cupid but was put to death by Venus. At Cupid's request, however, Jupiter made Psyche immortal. Now, don't mind me, only a few would understand that, but if you do, please indicate it in the comments below. There may be something there for you. Let's move on. If everything goes to plan, Musk rocket building companies SpaceX and NASA will launch an uncrewed spacecraft from Cape Canaveral in Florida in 2022, with it arriving at the asteroid in 2026. Tesla CEO Elon Musk's SpaceX aims to make space tourism a reality and ultimately let humans live on other planets. Now, technology has made a landing on an asteroid appear increasingly possible. However, anything mined in the early stages will likely be used in space and not brought to Earth. NASA, however, stated that the new device is intended to study 16 Psyche to find out more about the Earth's formation. Since we can't examine the Earth's core up close, exploring the asteroid Psyche could give valuable insight into how our own planet and others form. The space agency has designed Psyche's spacecraft, which will study the asteroid's magnetic field as well as capture images and data regarding the topography and composition of the asteroid. Early this year, NASA awarded SpaceX a $117 million contract to launch the Psyche spacecraft and two small sat secondary missions on a Falcon Heavy rocket in July 2022 and on a Falcon Heavy rocket from Launch Complex 39A at Cape Canaveral in Florida. NASA said the Psyche mission will test a sophisticated new laser communication technology that encodes data in photons rather than radio waves to communicate between a probe in deep space and Earth. Using light instead of radio allows the spacecraft to communicate more data in a given amount of time. So what do you think would happen if the asteroid is explored? If that kind of goal reaches our planet, do you think everything would still go well? Let us know in the comments below. And like always, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, click the like button and subscribe. And if you want to find out more stuff or there's something you want me to talk about, please let me know by leaving a comment below and I'll be more than happy to make the video. Don't forget to subscribe and click that bell. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you in the next video.